Hi, maybe you want something like uh, this up on your walls as a decorative element. Cap Capers is a solution that works with uh, baseball caps and might be worth looking at for you. Let's take a look together in this video. Above my bookshelf I had a space where I could use something both as a decoration and to help get better acoustics in my home office. After doing some uh, research I came across Cap Capers, a simple but uh, very useful product that could help me solve this uh, issue. Cap Capers helps you attach uh, baseball caps to a wall or a similar surface with a few easy steps and uh, we'll go over those uh, steps here. Cap Capers uh, consists of a transparent uh, plastic uh, display. It's uh, quite flexible and can be attached to many different surfaces. They come in packs of uh, 1, 6, 12, 24, 96 or 144. I went for 12, ordered uh, through Amazon and uh, got them quite quickly. You simply attach the button on your baseball cap to the top slot and then attach the folded ends of the cap to the lower posts of the cap caper. The cap capers are attached to the wall with double sided foam adhesive uh, tabs that comes with the product. You can also use a screw or a nail as it's designed for that as well. I started out by measuring the spacing between the ceiling, bookshelf and each cap to make sure that they had the same amount of space between each other. When that was sorted out I started attaching the cap capers to their spaces on the wall and I used uh, adhesive tabs to attach them and uh, nothing else. In other words, uh, you don't need to use a nail or screw and uh, make a hole in the wall for these things. Uh, that being said, uh, there is a slotted hole for screw in the plastic, so you can if you want to. It doesn't take long to get this sorted out, although I do recommend spending some time on the measurements of the space on the wall to make sure that things look good. And that's pretty much uh, it for our first time installation. However, after approximately six months, I ran into an issue where some caps fell down due to the cap capers cracking. Notice uh, the vent to the left here. The issue had little to do with the product being bad, but uh, more to do with the, where a couple of them were placed. Both uh, cap capers to the left and right of the vent cracked, and this was due to cold air from the vent making the plastic brittle. Plastic items uh, may become brittle when exposed to large enough uh, changes in temperature, which is exactly what happened here. This in turn led to stress fractures in the most fragile parts of the cap capers. In other words, pay attention to the surroundings of where you place things. They can affect the quality of products over time, it's as uh, simple as that. I solved this issue by simply closing the vent and replacing the two broken uh, cap capers with a couple of new ones. This gave me a good opportunity to show you how to remove a cap capers too, so uh, let's have a look at how that's done. Remember that it's only attached to the wall with an uh, adhesive tab, so all I have to do is twist and turn the cap capers a little to get it uh, detached from the wall. I uh, clean the wall a bit using my fingers, followed by a wet cloth and then a dry cloth. It uh, didn't take too long. And then it's time to put up a couple of new ones using the same spots that I used before. Uh, first I add the double sided adhesive uh, foam tab to the cap capers. Then I attach it uh, to the wall and use my fingers to apply some pressure for a few seconds to make sure it gets a proper grip on the wall. Then I finally attach the baseball cap to the cap capers and then hopefully avoid the further issues. Cap capers is a product that works well for displaying baseball caps and um, I can recommend it after having used it for quite some time now. 
it has some uh, things to be aware of as we've seen in this video but other than that it's a product to go for oh by the way if you liked this video feel free to give it a thumbs up and uh, thanks for watching